Hi, everyone. Welcome to Glide Chat. This one's about GlideFast Consulting University, or as we call it, GCU. I'm Alex Darby, the director of training for GlideFast, kind of handle all things training, including this program that uh, we are running. Uh, the first run of it actually is going on right now. So we've cut out of work, left the students hanging in order to be able to talk to you guys about this. Uh, I've been in ServiceNow space for eight years, about, and been at Glide fast for going on a thousand days, thousand terrific days. Just basically running all things kind of training and helping out where I can with anything related to our clients and training. And now our new associate technical consultants and their training. Uh, and I'll pass this off to Diana to introduce herself. Thank you, Alex. Hi, everyone. My name is Diana Riveros. I'm the training program manager here at GlideFast Consulting. I work with custom training projects. I manage our internal and external trainings. And as well as the back end of this GlideFast Consulting University program that we've launched, it's been very exciting. I'm involved in the back end again of the activities. I've been in the service now space, I would say, for about eight years, I think, Alex. I think we've been about in the space for about the same amount of time. And at GlideFast for two and a half years. So it's been a little bit um, working with everyone. And now we'll pass the intro to Derek. Thank you, Diana. Uh, hello, my name is Derek Behunin. I am a instructor here for GlideFast Consulting University and a senior technical consultant. I've only been in the ServiceNow space for about two years. So thankfully I have a wealth of experience behind me to uh, help me. And yeah, I'll pass it off to Matt. Hey everyone, I am Matt Taylor. I'm one of the service delivery managers here at uh, GlideFast. And I am also one of the instructors for the GlideFast Consulting University Technical Consultant Program. Uh, I've been working in ServiceNow space for about two years. I've been in IT for almost 10 now. And uh, yeah. Perfect. And that is our team that uh, we've sort of taken uh, what we call GlideFast uh, University and uh, made it really big. Uh, so the way that the whole thing started was back in April, two great companies came together, uh, GlideFast and CloudFires. And the CloudFires company, uh, their junior development program was generally how they hired new people coming in. So they would uh, give people opportunities that didn't have ServiceNow experience, you know, maybe had a little computer program programming background or were just proficient or eager people to learn, bring them on. And the, the truly unique thing about the program is bring them on as employees and then train them for uh, the, the baseline is 90 days, but really it's the training process. Uh, you know, I kind of think of it as like a training hospital, if you've ever uh, experienced those where you're literally on the job trained with other people, you have a senior and a junior. So we really took their idea, which was one of the fundamentals of that company, and then put it on steroids, right? So they would have two to three different juniors or associate TCs at a time. Uh, we decided that why not do 15 to 17? <laughs> so <laughs> we, we uh, started with uh, 17 or 16, 17, depending on when their start dates were, uh, right after the 4th of July. We thought that was a good sort of Independence Day thing to do. And it's a 90-day program that really came about based on a couple of things, right? You know, you get to a level within service now, you get to a certain size of a company where you can actually start doing good for, you know, in our case, Ohio is where we're starting out, but we're planning on expanding, where we take people that, you know, we're not too stringent on requirements. You don't have to have a college degree. You don't have to have been in, you know, there's really no requirements other than, you know, we do prefer a little bit of a computer programming background, which could just be they play a lot of video games, or it could be that they've built their own kind of computer at home, or they understand how the internet works, or they've maybe done a little web design in college their sophomore year or whatever. But they generally have some type of background. That's definitely beneficial, but it doesn't have to be, it, it, you know, it could just be motivated, an extremely motivated person. So we, we sort of, focused on that, you know, that we we don't have to have somebody who's got a computer programming degree. They don't have to have five years of ServiceNow experience before they get hired uh, at GlideFast. They can come into this program, learn from our experts and our teaching methodology in order to be able to become, you know, producing members within our organization, but also 
introduce them into an ecosystem, which um, I'm sure as most of you watching this podcast agree is endless at this point, right? There's stuff that I read on LinkedIn where there's going to be a 2 million developer deficit within the next two years. So we really want to make sure the ecosystem has what it needs and then also use that ecosystem to provide people with lives that they would have never expected based on you know, the current demands that you'd see like on a LinkedIn or, or by other companies. But let me pass this off to Diana for your take on kind of what this is all about, what the whole program is about. Well, that was a great introduction as to what we're doing and how it'll serve with cloud buyers. Um, so the great thing about this program is that we are giving those who are interested in starting their career, maybe it's a career change, maybe it's an early career, the opportunity to come on during GlideFast, one of the best elite partners of service now, and just learn from the best. We have every person that works at GlideFest is just an expert at what they do. And so coming on, learning from the best, on the call, we have Derek who, and Matt, of course, who are one of the full-time trainers working directly with our associate TCs. It just provides an overall a great opportunity to get that career going in tech, specifically in service now, become that good technical consultant, um, not just on lecture of, okay, this is service now, we're going to take this class, we're going to go through the curriculum, but you're also getting hands-on practical experience, just learning from the best. And that's one of the best things about this. We're given those with zero background or experience the opportunity to learn and become a TC in the service now space. So I personally love that. I think it's a great thing we're doing. And now with our associate TCs, I mean, they're a great group of folks that are so excited to learn and just become a great employee of GlideFast and then eventually a TC too for the ecosystem. So that's my take on it. I've been involved in the back end, of course. I'm not working directly with the associate TCs, but it's been a great opportunity. I would like to hear more now from Derek, who is on the line working every day with these associate TCs. What is your take on this program, Derek? Yeah, I think this program is something truly incredible. Having gone through the Cloud Pires version of it, so seeing it in its infancy, it allowed me to jumpstart my career in tech. I've always been kind of a nerdy programmer guy, and I've been looking for my way into the field and the economy and the ecosystem. So to be able to have this low barrier of entry, if you're passionate, if you're dedicated, if you're a problem solver and you care about, you know, providing something meaningful to people, then you will thrive here and you'll be able to jump into this IT space and truly build amazing things and work on incredible projects. So if you can't tell, I'm madly in love with it. <laughs> um, and yeah, I'll pass it off to Matt. What's your take? Yeah, no, this has been a pretty wild ride. You know, Derek and I started on the same day learning all of this stuff together. We've been kind of in the trenches of figuring out how to use this platform together for quite a while and to, to be here trying to pass on the lessons we've learned along the way to the next you know group of developers getting started in this career path is is pretty amazing. You know, I have I've had a lot of crazy awesome experiences in the IT space over the last couple of years working with ServiceNow and just seeing what what it can do. You know, it can facilitate a lot of really interesting and cool business processes and kind of feed that creative outlet to take a bunch of, you know, tools and build something that, you know, you had never imagined before. And getting the opportunity to to teach that to people with an interest and a, sort of a creative bent in not only IT, but, um, you know, the creative space of building and creating things is has been pretty wonderful. Yeah, and it, just to point out to everybody, you know, we made it clear, Derek and Matt are products of the program at Cloud Buyers, you know, when it was on its smaller level. And, you know, one of the, so we had a merger, right? You guys have absorbed that, I'm sure. One of the things with a merger, there's always a lot of stress and anxiety over what is this new company like? What's the old company like? What's going to change about my job? and uh, things like that. And this was a significant change for GlideFast, right? Coming in and then being able to take this Cloud Pires program and then multiply it was something that all of us were, you know, we're not sure how this is going to work out to this level of scale. And uh, the things that have been, you know, pretty consistent, which is 
consistently a reason why we're being successful so far. Now, of course, we're just a month in, is it's on site, right? So we we have trainers that are dedicated to teaching pods, for lack of a better word, of five to six students on site together in the same building all of the time. So that you can really, and I've tried similar programs where we've been remote. We haven't really cracked that code yet on how for that to be successful. But this being on site, what we're seeing is everybody's bonding. You know, all the students are like becoming friends with each other just after a month. They're really into the program. We've had a lot of feedback. You know, we've been able to adjust the program on the fly, which is another amazing thing. We, we kind of attack the learning in, in three different stages. Uh, you know, you have a classic classroom led sort of teaching, which we rely on ServiceNow for. So ServiceNow trusts GlideFast to be an authorized training partner. So we deliver classes for them, like publicly, you know, like you would go attend a class and pay for it. Uh, we do that a lot. But then we take those classes and we put them into this program. So we have this one learning style, which is a classroom approach. And you all are on or familiar. That's like you have training instances that are ServiceNow instances. You go through a book, you do labs, you learn the basics of ServiceNow. But then a second thing we do is we have real requirements that we, well, not exactly real, but real to a, to a degree uh, that they came from actual clients, either of Cloud Pires of, or of GlideFast that they complete, right? So that's the next level. They take that knowledge they've learned through a textbook, through basically being told, and then they apply that to requirements that they're going to have to actually do in the real world. In addition to taking advantage of all the great free training that's out there from ServiceNow, Chuck Tomasi's video series on JavaScript, if you haven't watched that, that's required reading for anybody in ServiceNow. We use that. We use the developer site. Basically, whatever we can get our hands on, it's been now learning, 600 free courses on there. We use all that material and we bundle that together with a dedicated trainer who helps them walk through all of that. And then our final piece will be like literally putting them through a project with a client where we'll sort of simulate being clients. They have to take down requirements and complete them, go through the process of development, demonstrate what they've done. And that will sort of be their final, not test to say, their final learning experience before they're released into the client world, where of course, you know, they'll be with senior level trainers as they go throughout. But literally, after three months, they'll have gone from somebody who's never logged into service now to being able to move things with an update set into from a dev to a test environment uh, for a client project. It's just really exciting. And, you know, the experience of the folks that are with me on this podcast have allowed it to happen to where we can literally pivot on the fly. Okay, this isn't working for learning. Let's go this way. So there's a lot of feedback that's been coming through that we've changed on the fly. But overall, I would say, you know, if you're interested in joining this, you just have to have a desire to learn. You have to be focused, right? It's not easy. This is not an easy program. You're coming in to learn a whole new piece of software in 90 days and then expected, you know, you're an employee of ours. So it's a job that you, you have to do. So it's not for the faint of heart, but if you have dedication, if you have know a little bit about computers, then come and talk to us because we will definitely be doing this again. Yeah. And if you are listening to this podcast, watching us on YouTube, you can apply by going to our company website, glidefest.com. Within the resources section is a tab there will be a link to GlideFest Consulting University. And within that website, then you can go on and submit your application. Excellent. We hope to hear from you guys.